Alright, so if I tinker over here, kind of get the wire good over here. Okay, oh! Why, hello there. My name is Billy Samuel. Y you, you announce your name every time we meet each other. Yes, I know. It's a habit for a very long time. Now, what you working on with this bomb? Why are we whispering? Well, actually, you started whispering. I'll hit that thing with my shovel. Take that bomb. Wait, no, no. Stop, 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 stop. You're going to make it explode. Wait, that's a bomb? I thought it was my pair of glasses that I didn't want anymore. What is wrong with you? Never mind. Basically, we have a situation. Why'd you destroy the park bench? I, I never liked those benches. The wood was rusty. I preferred benches to be made out of quartz. That's a lot of quartz. Do you know how expensive that'd be? I have expensive tastes. Now, if you want to test explosives, I'm your guy! And I disappear into the bush. Billy Samuel, I think you're getting a little C now. What C now? What, what, what's a C now? Now, where did I put my Nuka Cola? God, what is wrong with you? Yeah, you'll never see me in this bush. You'll never get me, you Nazis. Ooh. Billy Samuel. Oh, what you doing? Oh, Billy Samuel, stop that right now. Now, what did I, where did I put this remote detonator? Billy Samuel put down my detonator. Don't worry, I know what I'm doing. Oh God, Peter Samuel, what have you done? <laughs> oh God, oh God, we're getting under attack. <laughs> I can take these people down in two swaps. Why are you doing this, Billy Samuel? I'll explain in the car. We gotta shoot them. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta shoot our way out of here. <laughs> The jail's been taken over by the cult. They're dressed up as Americans. Or, well, I mean, like, they're dressed up as, like, not cult people. I don't really know how to put it. <gasps> they even dressed up like me. How can you possibly dress up like me? Take this, imposter. You'll never get me. We gotta get out of this jail. We'll call for backup later. <sighs> That's why I was acting all senile. I wanted to see if they'd notice. Because everyone knows that I take medication for my senileness. And they, they were all like, w what are we going to do? I mean, does he take medication? And they know they're supposed to give me my pills whenever I start acting senile. That's how I knew they were cult members. The real people are probably captured at the outpost. Because one of our outposts has gotten taken over, and we need to go liberate it. That's where the real Zelda is located. All right, I'm on it, Billy Samuel. Now let's drive somewhere. I need you to shoot, kid, because well, you have better perception than I do. I'm very um, I'm very senile. I don't shoot well. I can't even see where I'm driving sometimes. But don't worry, this this drive should be very smooth. It should be a smooth ride. Uh, I don't think I should be leaning out the car. Nonsense, kiddo. Just stick your head out the car and look for them piggies. Okay. Yeah. Oh, oh, there's my pet burger. Your pet burger? I mean pet cheeseburger. Come on, cheeseburger, follow us. Well, you have a pet bear? Well, I mean, I bought him for five bucks in Alabama. He was a good deal. There's a lot more animals that I could buy that were a lot more expensive. I could have bought a dog for ten bucks, but I was like, nah, a bear for five dollars? That's a best deal. That's a, that's a hoot and holler and KFC deal. I had to get that. The best choice of my life. Mm-hmm. Also, going to law school was a pretty good choice. Even though I pretty much not did not end up being a lawyer. But enough about me. How are you doing, kiddo? How are the flashbacks been? Uh, the flashbacks haven't been well. They've, um... They've been getting worse. Oh, I'm sorry, kiddo. You see... The reason I don't get many flashbacks is because in the good old World War II, I pretty much, here's what I did. We were supposed to like storm this beach full of Nazis, right? And the second I got off the boat, I grabbed my shovel, dug a hole in the ground, and hid in there like a little gopher. I had to cover myself up with sand and my fallen comrades. And then I waited there for like eight hours, and then the war was over, and I got the Medal of Honor. Now, now kiddo, that's what you should have done. That's a cheap and easy way to get the Medal of Honor. Did you really do that? Why, well, yes I did. Why do you think I don't have a single battle scar? I, I, I kind of also skipped boot camp. My father was kind of rich, so he just kind of paid my way out of there. I did it for the benefits and to avoid the, well, to kind of, well, I was drafted, okay? And I did the best I could to, to avoid the draft, but I was like, if I'm going to run for mayor, I can't ditch the draft because they look into that stuff. So I had no choice but to join up the army. 
Now get out of here. We gotta be silent. Silent but sneaky. Now get on that box, kid, and I'll catch up to you. I'll cover you with my here sniper rifle. I'm all right, Billy Samuel. Now where did I put my benthanol? What's benthanol? I don't know. I really do not know. Oh god, kid, you're gonna get detected. Get out of here. Oh yeah. Tuck and roll, kiddo. That was a terrible idea. Don't worry, the AC was rigged with explosives. Wait, really? Nah, I'm just pulling your leg. What is this terrible music? It's called Johnny Casino, the worst musician to ever walk the earth. This is Johnny Casino? It is Johnny Casino. Now, how do you work that there bow of yours, kid? How does it work? Well, you grab the bow, you pull back the arrow, and it shoots an arrow. I've never thought of that. I would assume you would not. Now take him out, kiddo. We ain't got all day. We got two hours to sunrise. Here I go. Hours of darkness. <laughs> oh, he's not dead, kiddo. Oh no, guys, shoot him quick. He's gonna ring the alarm. I'm on it. Oh, dang it, we got compromised, kiddo. I don't blame you. There was no way for us to get out of this. We gotta go loud. We got... I'm on it. Come on, kiddo. You gotta shoot. You gotta fight like you gotta shoot. You're not making any sense. I'll stop talking now. They're everywhere. Cover fire. Cover fire. Ten to base. Ten to base. Was that World War II radio talk? No, it was not. What was I getting hit from? Oh, God. Hi, buddy. How are you doing? Ah. Oh. Now cheeseburger! Go for the cheeseburger! You gotta bite him in the cheeseburger! What's the cheeseburger? Well, the cheeseburger is kinda like the gold ladder, but it's a little different. He's... We did it, kiddo! We liberated it! Now let's go celebrate with some beer! Oh yeah, go celebrate with some beer! Come on, folks! Come on and join us! We did all the work. You better carry that weed. Mm-hmm. Now donate it to my sanctuary about a few miles back. There you go. Take the marijuana out of the building and put it in my truck. I'll make good use of it in about five minutes. Mm-hmm. Are you really going to take it? What are you going to do with all this weed? You're going to die before you get to smoke even a whole brick. You'll be surprised, kid. Back in my day, I smoked 18 feet of rope a day. That sounds extremely unhealthy. Well, when you're young and you're in your mid-40s, Mid-40s is not young. It's young to me, and that's all that matters. You did a good job today, and you were able to avoid any flashbacks. Well, that's because I'm on some heavy, heavy medication at the moment. It makes me talk a little high-pitched. Yeah, that's why you're sounding like you're 12 years old today. I do not sound like I'm 12 years old. Yes, you do. It doesn't make my voice that higher. It just takes out the gruntiness of my voice. Well... It doesn't matter now, even if you do sound like a 12-year-old, you're a good partner, and that's all that matters. Now, where'd you go next? Oh, we should go to the drive-thru and get us uh, some burgers to celebrate. Burgers to celebrate? Yes siree! They baked the best burgers on the west side of the city here this year destination. Okay, now let's hope the burger place has not been taken over by this here cult. What if it is? Well, then we'll liberate it from the people. The, okay, listen to me. Remember when the cult first started taking over and they practically had the entire map taken over and then we had to kill the Jacob, the John, the Faith, and that Joseph? Yeah, we had to kill all four of them. That is correct. And he blew up that entire mountain. And that mountain is still being repaired. How do you repair a mountain? Well, you see, you grab McDonald's and a bunch of rocks and you just pile them on up. There's a cult truck. Shoot at him. You are really fast at shooting, kiddo. I learned some reflexes. Now, hang, hang on. I'll put the bomb on the car. Drive away. Just back up for a second. Just back up. Just back up for a second. All right, now back up, Billy Samuel. Back up, back up, back up. Ugh. It doesn't matter. I'll just get here in the back and lean out the car. I have a better idea. What are you doing? The car's not even driving anymore. Just back up and let me blow the thing up. We got a heavy machine gunner. Why is the cult in this area? I thought we killed all of you about five months ago. I guess they're still not dead yet. Come on, shoot them. They used to run this land, and now they're nothing but common criminals. RPG in the house! Where did you learn to shoot like that, kiddo? I, uh... <laughs> I've learned to shoot many weapons. Take him down while he's down! Kick him while he's down! Kick him! 
He's gonna blow it a time soon. Just like my marriage. Connect the base, tag the base, fix my marriage ASAP. Now we gotta be very stealthy. I'm very surprised they did not hear all the explosions around the whole base. Explosions? Yes, it's the countryman way of saying explosions, but we say explosions. You gotta be very quiet and very stealthy. You don't want to disturb the manga goose. What's a manga goose? That is a manga goose. It looks like a dog. That is what a manga goose is. You mean a mongoose? No, a manga goose. What are we heathens? Is this place even taken over by the cult? No, it is not. Oh, I'm at the wrong base. Yes, you are. I told you that the base was about five miles up here. Now get back in the car, you idiot. I'm used to seeing a building and thinking it's taken over by a, an organization of some sort. Exactly. That's why you need a break. Of taking over more organizations. Yes. Now where did I put my sunglasses? Oh, I put them in the stereo. You put them in the stereo of your car. Yes, I did. Now get in that car. What did you do? Um, let's just say that gasoline company that makes that their gasoline is, um... That gasoline company put my, my, my son out of business. You have a son? Well, he was running for mayor, and then the CEO of the gasoline company ran, also ran for mayor, and he got mayor instead of him. I was supposed to pass on the family torch, and now every day I shoot his trucks full of gasoline. I hope to one day kill that man, but he died of a heart attack, so I can't regardless. That's a, that's a sad story. Why, yes it is. My son also died. What did he die from? Alligator hunting. An alligator will make a man go crazy. Absolutely crazy. Don't ever go near the alligators, kid. Um, keep that in mind! What are you doing, kid? We gotta get you to a hospital! You suck at this job!